Hello beautiful people, Lucy and Treya here. Okay, so I basically put out a video there because I didn't know what this uh, thing was. And I knew it was kind of a centipede or a millipede of some sort. Um, this is the second one. I'm sitting on my jacket. This is actually the second one that I've had a little bit of an encounter with here in my new home in Fort Myers, Florida. And it crawled like the last one right up under my toes. I felt it tickling my foot. And of course, I looked down expecting to see a pit data bug or maybe even a roach, which I don't have in this house. But there's no wonder now why I know I don't have roaches it's because I have centipedes. And these things like to eat things like termites and stuff. Um, it's actually, I found out, it's called a Florida blue centipede or a Hemascolopendra marginata. Anyways, I'll put it down in the description box below. Uh, but apparently these things are usually found under rocks or lakes or brush or moist areas and or unfortunately places where there might be termites. Now, I don't know if this house has termites. I've never seen them. Um, it's kind of a new house. I think it was built in about 2006 or so. And I don't know. I just... Uh, I've seen some flying ants outside, which might be some sort of a termite. But what I do know is now what it is. Um, they say that they can bite, but they can't kill humans. Uh, they just make a little sting, and it should go away in a couple of hours. That's not the point. I really don't want to get bit by anything out here. I get bit by red ants or something, and they turn into this pimple about three days later. And I'm not too happy with um, the feeling of that, as you could probably imagine. But... Um, he's still here, curled up in the corner of this thing, and I don't know if I can pan that down in there. He's still moving. And apparently people collect these things, and they catch them and keep them in jars and whatnot, and he's really a fast guy, even though... I tried to kill him, and I'm sorry to you bug lovers out there if you're watching this. I don't know what it is. I just know that it scared the heck out of me. I don't like to kill things. Sorry. I don't like to kill things that are in nature. Um, I'm, a, I'm a self proclaimed witch, we'll say, and I believe in nature and things kind of, you know, um, coinciding with one another and. You know, I don't bother you, you don't bother me, but I don't know where these things are coming from and why am I getting them. This is the second one I've had in less than a couple of months that I've lived here. I've moved into this house the beginning of June, and here we are almost the beginning of August, not yet even, so it hasn't even been two months, um, and this is the second one. Anyways, so I know what it is, so if you saw my other video and you're commenting to it, thank you very much. I found out what it is. Um... But there's really, I don't know, I, I was just doing some research online and reading and they said, you know, some people were saying they've tried to exterminate for them and, and they're able to effectively kill everything else that they have showing up in their house, but um, not these things. So I don't know if they're just industrial insects and um, I, I'm, I'm wearing shoes now. <laughs> uh, Open-toed, but still, I'm wearing my my sandals. I'm just so freaked out, really. I don't want to get bit by anything. I'm afraid that one of my dogs or, or cats or even my little kitty cat, if that thing would have got that little tiny kitty cat that I have here in the house now, Blue. Oh, God. And I call the cat Blue, and this thing is a blue centipede. Anyways, hopefully you don't have these insect issues. Um, I guess it's the price you pay for living out in seclusion. Be happy, be healthy, be beautiful. You see, I'm worried about it looking at it. Just be you. Be the boss of your own loss if you're on a weight loss journey. Keep your feet to yourself and or up and above the floor or uh, in shoes if you live in Florida and you're afraid of insects. I'll see you in my next video, guys. Bye.